Hi, my name is Alex with ATEC Tech Tutorials, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to use Jira Work Management as a content creator. If you've been looking for a tool to help you get organized, how to plan your work, and most importantly, on tracking your execution of your ideas and your videos, then Jira Work Management is going to be the perfect tool for you. Not only because it's super awesome, but because for up to 10 people in your team, it is absolutely free. If you haven't already, please make sure you smash that subscribe button as it greatly helps out the channel. And if you like anything in this video, please make sure you smash that like button as well. If you have any questions about anything that I'm covering in this video, please make sure you drop your questions in the comment section below and I will get to your comment. All right. I want to start off with showing you the Jira, the official Jira work management marketing material. So you kind of get an understanding, a visual of what it is this tool does. And then in another video, we're going to jump into the configuration of your first project. And then in the final and third video, I'm going to show you how I, as a content creator, use Jira work management to do exactly what I'm telling you, which is I'm taking my ideas for my videos. I'm organizing them, putting them into Jira so that I can at least be accountable so that I can collaborate with my team and so that I can actually visualize the execution of me actually doing the videos. And so make sure again, you are fully subscribed to this channel. Make sure you drop a like because you are not going to want to miss out on any of these videos, especially if you're a new content creator looking for the perfect tool to get started. All right. So here we are at Atlassian.com slash software slash Jira slash work management. And this is just Atlassian's homepage for their marketing material of what Jira work management does. I want to highlight that. Jira work management compared to the other Atlassian products is probably the most friendliest. And this to me is very important as a content creator because the, how technically advanced or savvy you need to be to use this tool is very, very low. And that to me is very valuable because I'm not going to have to spend more than the 10, 15 minutes watching these videos to get started. I don't have to invest a lot of money, a lot of time, a lot of resources to just get my ideas from my brain into a tool so that I can get organized and start actually making videos. So Jira work management is going to be perfect for you because of that just friendly nature. It's very powerful. It's also still Jira. So if you're used to the more powerful Jira version, this is still going to feel right at home. It's completely free. And let me just highlight a couple of things. One, you get this list view. This list view is going to be perfect because you're going to be able to capture every video idea that you have. You're going to be able to see what status that video is with respect to are you, are you in scripting mode? Are you in editing mode? Are you in recording mode? Are you in publishing mode? Where are you? Right. And this view is going to give you a very, very big high level overview of where everything is at. If you have a team of more than one person, so maybe you have another collaborator, maybe you have an editor, maybe you have a writer, you're going to be able to assign work to them and you're going to be able to see who's responsible for each item. And most importantly, you're going to have a due date. And this is really where the accountability part comes in. You're going to be able to very easily and visually see when is everything that is related to your project and to your video going to fall or be due. And that is really key. And then the last thing here that you'll see is your priorities. This is really important too, because not everything's created equal. Maybe some videos are more important than others. And this helps your team get organized and structured so that they're working on the highest value, more important things first, and then work on the less things a little later. So that's the list view. You also get when you're in this Jira work management, a calendar view, the calendar view, again, great visual that will show you and help you see when is all your stuff due so that your team can be accountable. They can stay on schedule and so that you know exactly when everything should be completed by the timeline is a very similar view. You're going to just have every item again, and you're going to have the person responsible and then it's going to be in a more traditional, what we call a Gantt chart, which is this little graphic here where you're going to see a start and end date and you're going to see the duration of every task. And then you'll see the overlap and how, different tasks can be run in parallel or which ones need to be done in sequential, which basically means one after the other. And then finally, if you've been using Jira for as long as I have, the board view is probably going to be the one that's the most natural. 
the one that just feels the most Jira like because this is just going to be a simple board that is going to allow you to actually move your items from status to status in the most visual way. Mm -hmm.